Good morning, room parents. I apologize that I cannot be with you this morning. I am at LACE, the Leadership Academy for Character Education up at UMSL. This is an opportunity that I've been in a year-long project uh, learning about character education to make point a, be a better place. And so today is very important for me to be there to continue to, to learn and apply those principles here at Point. But it is, it is equally important for me to be with you guys as well. So we've created this short video that will hopefully walk you through and answer a lot of your questions. First, you all, all received the room parties information packet. If you have a quick second, can you go ahead and open that, find that packet and open it up as we will begin to go through this packet together. And hopefully I'll be able to answer some questions for you along the way. First, our party dates. Those are listed there for you. That is Halloween will be October 31st. The winter, ho the winter holiday party will be Thursday, December 19th. And the Valentine's Day party will be February 13th of 2014. Those are our party dates and those are set by the district. The party time, the winter party time will be a morning 9.30 to 10.30 party. Uh, we did that last year um, so that should be somewhat uh, no surprise to everyone as we are looking to try to find better ways to, to do our parties. Please remember um, the other party dates, the Halloween and the Valentine's parties will run from 2 to 3 in the afternoon. Parking, as always, many of you already know, parking is a premium here at Point, especially on party days. So please carpool if you can, or uh, make arrangements to drop uh, stuff off uh, before school or the night uh, before the party. We can make arrangements to help ease the congestion of our parking lots. Um, everyone has had and collected a $10 uh, party fee. This will help cover the costs um, for your parties throughout the year. Some of you, uh, you will use all of the money, some of you won't, and will end up using and buying pizzas or something for the kids or uh, something that the teacher recommends for the kids at the end of the year. As always, please remember all food items served in the parties must be within our wellness policy. Um, and that attached in this packet is a calculating sheet so that way you can make sure that you're uh, asking for approval on snacks that meet the, the wellness policy. Uh, for more information on this, please go to the website, the, the Melville School District website, under the student tab and elementary parties. Uh, due to state law, all snacks and treats brought to be shared must be individually wrapped. Uh, no homemade items can be uh, served or given since we need to make sure that we can uh, ensure that all the, the ingredients fit and match with what we're, uh, we're doing to keep our kids safe. For um, if any items that you're purchasing that are not on the food supply list that the district supplies, you need to submit those labels to Mrs. Cook by October 1st for the 31st party. Um, if you're a couple days late with that, that's no problem. We understand that, that that's only a week away, but anything that you can do to try to get it to her as soon as possible would greatly help us and make sure that she can make sure that it meets and falls within our wellness policy. Um, also, please feel free to, to expand and look at other ways of supplying fun things for the kids, such as puzzle books, uh, activity books, stickers, markers, bookmarks. Those types of items um, do not require uh, any food and keep it out of our wellness policy. And sometimes this is easier um, for our uh, party planning. Um, as always, our parents, you all it's sitting in this room are the best resource for different games. Here in a few minutes, we're going to give you some opportunities to collaborate and talk about different parties and the way that you want to, to do things. Sharing of information and different party ideas and different things that, that were done at different grade levels is an excellent way uh, to learn about new ways of doing things and, and to keep things fresh and, and renewing. Um, the, the parties to keep the kids engaged and, and keep them excited. So all of you in this room are experts and it's going to be awesome for you guys to have an, a few minutes to talk and share different ideas and, and get excited about this, this upcoming school year. And we do thank you for doing this. Um, this is such a big deal because these are the parties that the kids remember. We want to make sure that we're supporting you in anything that, we, that uh, you need help with. So please feel free to contact the office and we will help you in any way we can. Um, the in one year sheets is the food allergies. 
while we have not told you the names of the kids, we've listed the teachers and what allergies are in those rooms. And these are things to um, be conscious of and look at the, those labels, those ingredient labels, to make sure that we're not putting any kids in, in harm's way. Um, so as you look that over, if you have any questions, Mrs. Cook, our school nurse, is awesome. She'll be able to help you any way she can and uh, help work through some of those things. But as we are not identifying the child for you, we are telling you the type of allergy so that way we can plan and keep our kids safe. That sums up our room parties. Now, uh, Mrs. Grass, my secretary, is here with you guys today. I know if you there's any questions that I did not answer, or if, or if I caused any questions to be at that have have raised during this conversation, please feel free to ask Lisa, and she will get with me on uh, Thursday, and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. But most importantly, thank you for all you do. Thank you for your efforts in these parties, and helping create memories for our children here at Point that will last a lifetime. Thanks, and have a wonderful day.